Okay guys, today's video will consist on these dash cameras, why only one of them is worth its value and all the rest are actual garbage, garbage to stay the hell away from. First one, around $30, pure garbage. Second one, almost garbage but not worth $60. Third one, pure garbage even for two dollars fourth one is the absolute best camera i've ever owned and fifth one the worst i ever owned let's exclude some of them that are blatant lies this one says full hd 1080p this camera does not even record in 480 not even 480 so put it on the pile the second one this one has a beautiful form factor. Maybe for the time it was made, it was better. But for today, this camera is complete useless for any real world application. You can barely see if it's a car or an airplane in front of you. On the pile it goes. Third one, cross tour. Cross tour to be kind of fair with them. It's not the worst camera. This is not the absolute worst camera, but it's not worth the money you will pay for it. It's not worth the money you pay for it. It's around 60 bucks most places. I don't know, maybe you've seen it cheaper, but I haven't seen it any cheaper than 60. It kind of records okay, I guess. In this case, I'm not sure if you can even see the screen here. Right here, my finger is right here. And it just, it sucks. It, it does a really sloppy job. It does a really sloppy job on recording. It's not worth the $60. And uh, if I can turn it back off, it would be great. Put it back there. <clears throat> now, we have... <laughs> this one, I'm not even going to bother. I will not even bother to waste your time with the fakest full 1080p I've ever seen in my life. The absolute fakest this one even for one dollar toss it on the garbage because it's not worth it so now we come to this one right here this one here is yada 4k road cam it's called yada 4k road cam it is the best camera i've ever laid my hands on for under 40 bucks i bought it for 35 on ebay I will link the guy that's still selling some of them on eBay, the Yada 4K. I'm not affiliated in any way, shape, or form. He doesn't know I exist, but I stumbled up on his eBay uh, profile, and I found this camera, and uh, I, let's say, I'm extremely happy with the quality of this camera. This camera features a micro sd card the reset button on this side power button right here you see usb c that's the one that you connect on the car and the other one is the usb you connect the rear camera in the other side you have the function buttons which are uh, menu okay up and down and uh, let's turn on this camera and show you that it actually looks really beautiful and it really records in 4k in 2k and 1080p and if we go to the settings of this camera as you see if my camera can focus here you have the resolution that you can ch switch it as you see it has 4k 3840 by 2160 it has 2k 2560 by 1440 and full hd 1920 by 1080 i've recorded a few clips on uh, 4k which i will show you on this video you will probably see it right now Next setting here 
will be loop record loop uh, recorded five second clips motion detection exposure which is your light audio you can record or not g sensor now this here to me is worth its all money you can set it high medium low or off what the g sensor does is that god forbid you got into an accident this camera will actually back up a few moments before the accident up to i think two three minutes and minutes after the accident so it makes sure that it captures every single detail on the accident and how it does that is very beautiful this camera will detect shock when it's hit at a certain level that detects that vibration it uh, indicates to the camera itself that the car has been on a wreck and other settings on this camera are going to be uh, screensaver frequency 60 hertz 50 hertz charging or usb mode beep sound when you click the buttons boot sound when you turn on and turn off language date and time format the card and all the rest which are not really that important miles per hour or kilometers per hour you can stamp your date on it and you can check the software version and the regulatory settings as i am recording this i will try to record this portion of the video with this camera and you look at it for yourself it's recorded in 4k and i will lay over this screen on your screen right now and you'll see it for yourself i will show you some road drive as well so you'll see the quality of this beautiful camera and i hope you learned something and as always thank you for watching this video has not been sponsored but i will leave the links to this camera anyway see you next time bye